up, what's up? It's Wizard Kelly. If you don't know me, I am an American living in England and I make videos about bullshit, about my life, about what I be doing, different things that I experience in this country. Um, I'm gonna try to make this video a random, let's go grocery shopping video with me. Um, only because I wanna use this camera and kinda walk around with it and see, you know, how to do all of the things. Um, so we're gonna go to the commissary and the British grocery store, it's called Sainsbury's. I'ma see how much I'ma record, I'ma try, I'm a little nervous, but you know, we're just gonna go from there and take it, you know, step by step, item by item, <laughs> okay? <laughs>
is back from the store. Let's see what we got. <laughs> I haven't even looked at the footage yet, but like I said, this was the first time I used this camera. I just wanted to use it just so I could play with it like a first video so I can really just, you know, play with it, learn what to do and not to do. So hopefully once I play it back and then we get to this point, we should be good. So what I got from the store. Your girl. The first two bags are gonna be from the commissary. I did not record at the commissary because I was nervous. I felt like commissary Americans, they could look at me, look at me like I'm crazy. And there's a bunch of military, you know, so I was like, mm. But once I got to Sainsbury's, that's kind of, Sainsbury, that's everything that you saw. And I did not, um, I didn't care. I was recording, they could look at me like how they want to. It was good. So, this. This. <sighs> I just, it's called Somat. I don't really know. I think it's German. A lot of the stuff that we get in our commissary. I don't know if I should look at the camera or the, I really don't know. But a lot of stuff that we get in our commissary, it comes from the main like store in Germany. But this is basically because we have hard water, so it's like very, it's like salt essentially. And it's like big, like big chunks of salt. And we pour it in our dishwasher because it helps the dishwasher because the water is so hard. I don't know, but here, this is literally like big grains of salt. So. I got two of these. I also bought some Alfredo sauce, so it's four cheese Alfredo. I've never used this brand before. The commissary was so bare. This was literally the only Alfredo sauce that they had on the shelf. So this is what I got. I got two of them though. So yeah, I'll make, I plan to make shrimp alfredo. So I got that. Also bought an onion. <laughs> and then I love Carmax. So I need one by my bed, in the living room, in my car, in my kitchen. Yes, and then I feel like I've seen people with these. This is the um, Nivea brand. So I said, I'll just, I'll try this too. But it's all just for my lips. Cause my lips be dry. Also got some angel hair pasta. Like I said, I plan on making shrimp Alfredo um, on Sunday. So I got that. Some tea. This tea is ginger and peach herbal tea. I really like this, I like peach tea. I have a whole like tea box, let me show you. So this is my tea box. And the front says tea and like a little definition. The aromic beverage prepared from tea leaves by soaking in boiling water. And then I open it and I just have all my teas in there. So I have the peach and ginger one. I also have Tazo Refresh Mint. And then a new one that I got, I tried and really liked it was Tazo Passion. So yeah. Okay. So this is yogurt. 
I don't know if it says yogurt anywhere on the packaging because it's all uh, German, but I've had it and it's good. It's just blackberry yogurt. <laughs> then I bought some shrimp, large cooked shrimp, peeled, deveined, tail off. Shrimp. And also some voila, or viola, whichever way you wanna pronounce it. But it's chicken alfredo, it's just like a stir fry. You literally put it on the stove in a skillet with some water and you let it sit with the top on for like 15 minutes and it's wonderful. I love to put steak sauce on this. I might eat this for dinner tonight. I still have, so last week I made chili and like baked potatoes. So I might warm that up, I need to but I'm kind of like over it. Like I always cook and then by the end of the week, I don't want it no more. So I might do this, I don't know. But I absolutely love this. This shit is good, quick, and easy. I bought some eggs, <laughs> 12 large, 12 large British free range eggs. this cereal. I saw this cereal like the last time I went to Sainsbury and I put it in my basket, but then I went to self-checkout and I always have problems at self-checkout. Like the lady has to, I think you saw the lady has to freaking come and put like, all, because I put my stuff in my own bag, I don't like use their bags. And I left it, and I, I didn't pay for it, but I left it. And yeah, so I wanted to try it. So it's just country crisp with 70% dark, Cocoa dark chocolate. So basically just like cereal with just dark chocolate clusters. I wanted to try it. Um, okay, the next thing is I got some bread. Just pretty self-explanatory. I like that this is like a smaller loaf of bread cause you know like a general loaf of bread, like a big size loaf of bread. I don't eat that much bread it's just one person. I don't need a whole loaf of bread because it'll just go bad. But I found that I like this bread because it's like a smaller loaf. And then it's funny because I don't even eat like the whole square. I like cut some of it off because I don't be needing all that. But yeah, bread. <laughs> How about some parsley? This is going to go on top of my shrimp alfredo pasta. So this is British double cream. I just needed half and half, y'all. And this is what I found. And it literally took me 15 minutes walking around the store to find this. Because usually cream and like half and half is in the dairy section. It wasn't in the dairy section that I thought it was going to be in. It was not about the milks. All they had was like cow milk, they had goat's milk, oat milk. I had to go to the other side where the yogurt and stuff was to find this. It was a lot. So I needed more Alfredo sauce, right? I don't think Brits eat Alfredo sauce. At least I didn't find it at Saintsbury, and that's a made like a like a chain grocery store, from my understanding, in the UK. But I found creamy white wine cooking sauce. We're gonna see. This is what it looks like. I hope this. 
does what I needed it to do. Creamy white wine cooking sauce with onions and mushrooms. We're gonna see. I literally, there, the word Alfredo wasn't even on the shelves. So I don't know. I bought some tomatoes. Three lemons, two limes. I put the lemons in my tea and I'm putting the limes in my pasta because I want to make like a pico de gallo. I was unable to find cilantro. I feel like out here cilantro has a different name because the word cilantro was also not on any of the shelves. I could not look it up in the store because for whatever reason in any grocery store of any kind, I don't have any service. And it's hard to connect to the Wi-Fi because you need service to connect to the Wi-Fi because you gotta fill out this form. It's a whole lot, so I didn't find this one. An onion, another, it's a little raggedy, but an onion. I bought some more, every time I go to the store, I don't know why, but I bought face towels. So I just bought some face towels. I bought a large like bath towel. And then last but not least, a spatula. I usually go to the store on Thursdays to cook for Sunday. I don't know why I picked those days, but that's just what I got. I usually go to the commissary always before I go to the British store. And I'm, I'm starting to kind of know where stuff is in the British store, trying to find my way. I, I do not mind asking somebody for some for something, um, like where something is, or try to help them, like the British version of what I'm looking for. So, because it'd be hard, y'all, trying to find stuff in a British supermarket. Like it took me a long time to find almond milk, because for the longest it wasn't in the dairy section. It was like on a wall far, far away from the dairy section. But hey, that was my experience at a British grocery store. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I always enjoy going to the store, I don't know why. Please like this video and comment below what you like or any suggestions on like any British grocery store I can go to or anything that basically you would like to see in my videos. Um, let me know how this video was. Like I said, this is my first time recording with this camera. So it was a lot of zooming in, zooming out, touching, like a lot of figuring and stuff out. But I still want to do the video. So we'll see. Thank you guys for watching and I'll catch y'all in my next one. Bye.